So it's Tuesday morning. Jonah's fever is officially completely gone and he is back to his normal self, which we're very happy about. Getting ready to have my last two meetings of the day. I've got my car washed today. It looks like a brand new car. And um, then I'm gonna go home. And um, today is actually leap second. What did you do for a leap second day? I guess it's called, I don't know. I think that's kind of cool. Anyways, I just heard an NPR story about it and kind of nerded out on how the earth is slowly slowing down so we get to add an extra second today. Yeah, I thought that was pretty cool. Okay, I saw this BuzzFeed video about how to make your own Nutella, so I'm going to attempt it myself. Two cups of dry roasted hazelnuts. Okay, two cups of powdered sugar. One cup of unsweetened cocoa powder. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. A little pinch of salt. One teaspoon of vegetable oil. And now we blend. Theoretically, we blend. Well, this was an absolute fail. So I just attempted to make Nutella and I got extremely frustrated because first of all, I may have broken my Vitamix. And second of all, this is what it looks like. It's possibly the simplest recipe that you could do. It's just blending four or five ingredients. And I consider myself a pretty good cook. So I'm really, really frustrated. Anyways, I'm taking a moment and Joe is putting Jonah to sleep. This is maybe the cutest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Whoops, just dropped my phone, but that's kind of par for the course today. Um, I just got home and you know, I just didn't have a good day. I don't know, something was just off and I was having anxiety and I don't wanna bring that energy into the house. I feel like Jonah can pick up on it and I'm just trying to talk it through and have a moment and just kind of you know, I'll, I'm not gonna jump back on email a bunch tonight. Maybe just like take a little time and read or write in my journal. I'm not sure. What do you guys do when you're super anxious? I'm just, uh-oh, I see somebody. Someone's here to make me happy. <sighs> All right, and put Jonah to sleep and I'm gonna go to the grocery store because I just need to get out of the house. I don't know what is going on with me, but I'm just in a horrible mood. So this is actually really cool. Um, at our Whole Foods, they have an electric charging station and Joe's new car is a plug-in Prius. Can you see that there? So um, I offered to drive it to the store so that he could, um, so we could charge it up because it was running low on batteries. So pretty cool. Poor Andy he has to go to the vet today to get shots. Well, because he's actually coming up on his senior years. Oh no, you're a senior yeah. citizen. Are you going to be a senior dog soon? No, still my baby. You're just going to get two shots, then you're going to be all good. This is Mike. Say hi. Hi. Mike. This is me. I'm me. Mike has taken me to this crazy event where people are dressed in costumes and we are not. So we are going to go in here and see what this is all about. But we're feeling a little underdressed. I'm just glad I wore a skirt thanks to Mike. Okay, so Mike and I are at Earth Cafe drinking boba. This is actually the place, well, one of them is where I told Mike that I was pregnant. So we have a special home. But behind me is this lovely car here blasting. What would you, how would you describe this music? Like, uh, maybe like Bollywood dance? Du Dubai pop. Like Dubai dance pop. Dubai pop. Dubai dance pop. They brought the dance pop to us. I think it's awesome. I think that like, they're infusing our life with dance. I have one question for the internet because we've been having this debate off camera for the last like two minutes. Pie or cake? Clearly both. No, but if you have to choose, right? It, it's a Sophie's choice. Cake. You cake choose all the way. You choose cake. I choose pie a hundred percent of the time. It's like your siblings. One of them is clearly superior to the other one. You can love both, but in in a dire moment of war, you you'd have to choose one. one you're, you, you, so your point is that there's more variety in pie, and it's deliciouser. That's not even a word. <laughs> It's Saturday, no wait, it's Friday morning. It's a holiday, so 
we don't have to go to work. Yay! And so we're gonna go to the beach. Jonah is officially 10 months old. Happy 10 month old birthday, baby. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna try and take his 10 month photos. I'm one of those annoying moms that takes like the photo every month. Um, but I try to do like something unique each month. But um, Eddie, as you know, went to the vet yesterday and they told us he needs to lose three pounds, which doesn't sound like a lot, but for a little dog, that's quite a bit. So I'm trying to walk him even more than we already do. And <laughs> Jonah, what are you doing? <laughs> Are you playing with a poop bag? That's not a good toy. We're at the beach now, and it's kind of chilly actually. Oh gosh, we have a little hoodie on, so that's good. So we're just gonna go take a little walk. Pretty sure that guy up there has a cat on a leash. And of course, Eddie is in my lap like a baby, and the baby is playing in the sand. Bag a bag, bag a bag. We're going to a lunch meeting. Lunch well, meeting. it's my lunch meeting, and I decided to bring some special guests because it's a lunch meeting with friends. Um, but it is about this nonprofit that I just joined the board of called Grocery Ships, which I will be telling you a lot more about in the coming weeks. But for now, just know that it's awesome. And I have a link in the description if you want to learn more about it. I don't know whose baby this is. <laughs> I'm just, I just want to give it back. No. Anybody? Anybody want a free baby? Free baby. Are you doing your own laundry? It's about time. Start pulling your weed around here. Wait. Aunt Christy's here. <laughs> and she brought a little hamster. <laughs> Say thank you. Oh my gosh, she's so excited. Oh. Okay, we left Joe at home with the baby, and my friend Christy, who I told you guys about, is coming, who came down from San Francisco today, is here. We're having a little girl's night out. She's very shy, so that's all you get to see of her all night. <laughs> Happy 4th of July! <laughs> oh, there you go. You're gonna share that with the world? That's so nice of you. Joe has gone to the grocery store because we're having an impromptu barbecue. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> this is his new thing. So the bug and I are just hanging out, waiting for our friends to show up. Oh, and probably pinching our fingers in the door. <sighs> Careful, baby. You don't want to do that. He is so mobile. It is crazy how different it is to have a baby who's just chill hanging out and a baby who wants to move everywhere and get in everything and when people forget to close the toilet and baby proof it. Hold on. No, no take this away from me. The phone? Yeah. Or the baby? <laughs> the phone, dude. <laughs> yeah, Cruz! <laughs> I mean, it's funny. From grilled peaches, goat cheese, hamburgers. Watermelon. Your plate looks good. I'm about to get some of them peaches on there too. Get some peaches. Don't mind if I do. Peaches, peaches and goat cheese. Peaches. 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 Well, I'd say that was a successful Saturday, 4th of July. Well, this night is gonna be very difficult, I believe. Why do you think tonight's gonna be difficult? Because the bug has been asleep for about five hours or so. That's true, Jonah went to sleep at 4.30 and... It's more than five hours, far more than five hours. This is his night. That night wasn't as horrible as we thought. Um, Jonah did wake up at two, um, but only took half hour to get him back to sleep. And then, you know, he slept till six. So I think he was just really, really tired. And now we're just gonna go for a little walk around the neighborhood. Oh, bless you. We decided instead of going to the barbecue because it's just kind of hard with a baby to walk around like this at a barbecue. That we're gonna go to the Natural History mm. Museum. Mm. We're gonna look at gems and dinosaurs and gems and dimes. And what else? What else is there? Butterflies. Butterflies, maybe. but we're probably not gonna get in there. Rocket ships. I don't think rocket ships are very natural. Good point. Very unnatural thing. Anyways, we've never been and we've lived in LA forever, so it's gonna be nice too. We're arriving. Natural History Museum. 
And guess what? The bug is asleep. I thought it was a paparazzi, but it's actually a wedding. Oh, or quinceanera. No, it's a quinceanera. It's a quinceanera. It's even better. I wish I could be 16 and Hispanic no. so I could have a It's 15, honey. Quinceanera. Oh, yeah. That means quince. I just want to wear the dress. Well, we can just get you a quinceanera dress. I know. They're like 80 bucks. What? Yeah. They're that cheap? Yes. This, yeah. is, this is too awesome. I think we wake him up. What is this? This is what I've been waiting for. I love, look how cool. Look at all of this. It just goes on and on and on. I don't know why these are so funny to me. <laughs> I'm gonna see the dinosaurs. What is this called? Nope. Walking with dinosaurs. The di dinosaur, dinosaurs amongst us. Walking with the dinosaurs amongst us. Something like that. Anyways, it's too dark to see. I will turn around. So what did you think of our excursion? It was super fun. I'm yeah. so glad we did it, and I'm glad we woke Jonah up, even though now he's sleeping in the bath. Okay, I hope you all have an amazing week. Don't forget to comment below. I love hearing from you, and we will see you next week.